are the craze. Yeah, we are the craze. DMV spotlight, no better time and no place. Time to yeah. undo all the hate with a place that allows you to show yeah. up all the talent you embrace. We, we are the craze. Yeah, we are the craze, yeah. No time for fake ones, only for the real. DMV, you know the deal. From the skins to the nationals, the weirds to the capitals, the capital here. We are the craze. Yeah, a place to showcase your skills. What's up? It's your boy DJ McSiam. And it's your boy Passport Los. And, and we, we the crates. crates. Man, we back here for episode five. Episode five. We definitely appreciate everybody showing us love, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? The thing is real out here, for real. real. You know what I'm saying? I'm feeling the energy. Uh-huh. Feeling the love. The feedback is marvelous. Man, what? What? And we glad to be here another week, man, mm-hmm. and just share what we got. The little bit that we got, you know, to bring to the game, man. So how you feeling, Los? Now we get busy. Uh, I'm good, man. You know, I can't complain. Had a nice weekend. You know okay. what I'm saying? Always a pleasure to come chop it up with my, with oh, my yeah. partner in oh, crime. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You, know. you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, I'm good, man. Everything's, everything's sunny on my end. Man, we getting ready for this big um, the big uh, opening, man. The, the uh, shoe opening. Yeah, the, the store. Shoe taboo. Yeah, this shoe weekend. taboo. Opening this Saturday. Yeah. Make sure y'all down there. We'll have all the info coming into you. So, Real soon. Yeah, Saturday at 9 a.m. Make sure you check the page, Instagram, the crates. We'll have all that information out there for you. Mm-hmm. So, man, what are we going to dive into this week, man? Man, we got to dive in, man. Right. <laughs> we almost lost the boss, man. Oh, oh. <laughs> we almost lost the man, boss. Real talk, real talk, man. You know, if y'all don't know who the boss is, we talking about Rick Ross. Rose. Rose. Uh. Young Renzel. You know what I'm saying? You know, man. Rose? Yeah. You it, know what I'm saying? It was <laughs> crazy, man, because I seen it online. And mm-hmm. when I saw it, I'm like, they said he on a, he on a grieving machine. Yeah, they, they were saying he was on life support. Yeah. You know, Fat Trail, you know, put... He co- he closed yeah, that, yeah, you yeah, know. Yeah, he, he was he, just like he verified and it said he what he clarified it and said uh, Ross, all right, he not on the machine. Man, man, that's even more reason why you gotta take care of your health, man. Cause yeah. I mean, even though you know you slam, I'm a little bigger, and at, at the same time, man, it don't even matter what you are. Cause Rick Ross lo- lost all that weight, and he's still dealing with them heart but problems. You want me to tell you what's crazy about him losing the weight? What's that? Once he lost the weight, that's when he started getting sick. Yeah, 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 you know yeah. What I'm but I mean, I just feel like you know you in that in this business, man. You dealing it's stressful. Yeah. I mean, you always on the go. Yeah. You always got deadlines. I mean, it ain't nothing really like free mm-hmm. for anybody. Mm-hmm. But at the same token, you still got to take care of yourself. Yeah, you, you know, do. we gonna dive into that a little bit more. You know, coming up weeks, man. We got yeah. plenty of people coming in for the fitness and talk about you know hip hop and what it means and then staying healthy, you know? Yeah, man, you got you got to make sure listen, if you ain't got nothing else in this world, man, you got to make sure your health is A1. Cuz sure. I be telling my partners, man, you know coming up in the streets, everybody feel like, you know, I don't feel no way I'm good. Mm-hmm. You got to make sure you keep up with these doctors appointments. You got to do little stuff yeah, in you dentist. Gotta get make, your annual. Yeah. Annual something. Come on, man, for <laughs> real cuz you got to be around long. But, for sure. You heard you heard about how they said he he had that? Nah, go ahead. Man, your man was supposed to be having a threesome. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh my goodness. He had a, they said they said the cause of it was he had a he had a he, he was had having a, too a much rendezvous. fun. He probably, probably took the pill. Wild. He got probably you think wild. he took the blue pill? Yeah, you know he a little older too, man. <laughs> when you get that old man threesome, you can't do that. All right, man. He in the life. But, you know, bringing it back, man, Rick Ross is a pioneer in hip-hop. You know, definitely one of my favorite rappers. I mean, one of his, his you know, his best album was his first album for me, Port of Miami. Port of Miami. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you can listen to that joint from beginning to end, and it was just like, damn. Man, like, Ro- where you come from? You know Ross what I'm saying? Make it, Ro- Ross make it cinematic before the, for um. Yeah, before the um. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? He make it cinematic. He he put you like Ross give you that real boss talk. He mm-hmm. make you want to get out here and get you some money. You for know sure, what I'm saying? Flip for sure, hustle. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Get a whole pound you out. Know, risk it all. Just all of. Just to live that just lifestyle. Get key. you a Versace shirt. <laughs> you know, but now nah, just for a Versace just shirt. Just for a Versace shirt. Yeah. You know what I'm saying, but Ross, he 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 paint that picture good. He his lifestyle, like he paint that rich person lifestyle mm-hmm. to a T. Like as far as the food, right. 
Because he got all the stores. Yeah, the Wingstop. You know and he got his hand in checkers, too. Oh, checkers or cheddars? Which one? Checkers. Ch- checkers. Okay, get you okay. A big he Buford. everywhere. Okay. Go get you a Buford or something, man. See, man, man I, I I can't do it no nah, more. Nah, see, you, you, you on a different path. Yeah, I'm on. <laughs> I'm still out there in the Mallys. I could go get me you a Buford. You get your Buford. I'm going to go get me a Buford. <laughs> yeah, man. So, you know. I think being him that he's a pioneer, we definitely can't afford to really lose him at this time. I mean, he's not done. Nah, you know, a lot not. of people saying he washed up now. I mean, nah. he pretty much doing the same type of music. But, I mean, I feel like it has some substance in it. He always got the notes. I mean, my favorite joints was his collab with uh, Drake. Mm. You know, stay scheming. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? You know, yeah. I live by that. Yeah, you know, yeah, she yeah. wasn't with you shooting in the gym. She wasn't with you shooting in the gym. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, for real, man, at the end of the day, man, you got to look out for your folks. Yeah. And then there's going to be people always trying to infiltrate, man. you know. And, and at the same time, you know, you just got to follow the people you loyal to. Hey, man, it's like that, man, in this life, man. You for know, sure. Like they say, like they say, everybody, once you get, once you start moving and making progress and moving forward in life, Mm-hmm. Some people can't go with you to the next stage. And me and you yeah. both know that. Oh, yeah, for sure. Some people, they not they don't have the mental capacity for mm-hmm. that, bro. Like, some people c- don't know how to deal with that. Like, I, you got some people that see you moving, and it's and, and sometimes it's overwhelming, and you got people around you that's a little, like, a little envious. Right, I get you. you gotta, I get you. You got to make sure that grass cut to see them snakes. <laughs> you <man. say laughs> you got to yeah. make sure the grass cut to see them snakes. Facts, bro. Facts, man. So, uh, speaking of that, snakes and and all that, uh, you know, erotic type stuff. Yeah. What's up with your girl? She back in the news again. Man. Black China. We talked about it last week. She man. can't seem to get enough. Man, man, man. You know what I'm saying? I heard. Uh-huh. This is what I heard. You know, uh, Sway Lee. Okay. Uh, who's that from? Ray Shraman group? Ray Shraman. Okay. His girl put on Snapchat. Okay. She just added Black China. Said she gave him the neck too. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So she just out here giving, getting everybody out the way. Everybody. I mean, at the end of the day, was she? I mean, she already was out there. I feel like even when you know Rob Kardashian got to her, she was already out there. I'm gonna say it again. Rob's a simp. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He was but, a stepping stone. Yeah, she but see, what I'm gonna tell you is, she used him. Well, I don't know. I think she was messing with Chloe first, like friends. Okay. And then she got with them, but she tried to, she tried to, you know what I'm saying, make Infiltrate. sure it was concrete. She right. said, I'm going to get with Rob. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. We're going to work this out. But then it, it leaves questioning why she has to even do that anyway. I mean, bro, you know, you got to understand, man. She, she, she a gold digger, bro. She yeah. trying to get it the way she can. She don't know no other way. Obviously. She just know how to get it how she live, bro. Obviously. You get what I'm saying? <laughs> That's all she know, bro. And Obviously. she going to keep on doing it. Like, this ain't going to be the last joint. I agree. I agree. But, you know, I guess you could just say do what she want to do. Hey. I I, I, I can't I can't even really take it there with her because shorty already on the X list for me. Yeah. Like you know if, what I'm saying? If, she's if, just if, doing ratchet if, stuff. If, I mean, it ain't no worse than Cardi B and yeah. her, you know, her see, situation. We ain't had no allegations <laughs> like this to her. They ain't slandering Cardi B name in this but, way. But I feel like everybody know where Cardi B came from too. Yeah, I mean, so she it's kind of like we all right. we already know she was already you know doing what she did. But, but Shardy, Cardi was a little wild anyway. But Shardy just out there. She just putting it out there. Oh like, yeah, bro. yeah. But I mean, she ain't no better than the next porn star, I guess. Hey, I ain't here to judge. All right, so we got a um, new album alert, man. So uh, what we got going with that? So you got we got that new Tory Lanez, Memories Don't Die. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? That joint just dropped. That joint, that joint got some good jumps on there. You, you might, you might, I mean, at least on the radio. The radio is like really throwing that beard joint. Yeah. Was it, what's it, Bust It Down? Yeah, something like Bust that. Bust It Down, I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. That so. joint all right. But I'm going to tell you, for those that ain't here yet, mm. it's a joint he got with 50 on there. Okay. It's called Pieces, and they telling a story. I'm telling okay. you, if you want to hear a good story, jump, listen to that Tory Lanez and 50 jump. Pieces. It's nasty. It's nasty. 50 Cent anyway is nasty. Yeah. Just off of his, man, that's one of my favorite rappers. Yeah. You know, your man really made nothing in, into something. Yeah, 50. Like, your man Hustle Game was on a whole nother level. 50, when 50 came out, he, he. I'm talking about he shook some stuff up, bro. He made it hard for a lot of people, bro. For sure. Man. So we, we got to give it up 
You know, you know we DMV. DMV. All the way. All the way. So, you know, we got to break it down. Let's give it up for Super Mo. Super Mo. He's a legend. Super Mo is a legend. He's a legend. He helping some of y'all community yeah. every day not get <laughs> tickets because you late for work. If you, don't, if you don't know who Super Mo is, look at the cameras that's on the ground yeah. in the streets that save y'all money every day going to and from work. I Put swear. some respect on his Man, name. don't be snitching on your man either. Yeah, I mean, he been quiet lately, though. Hey, because they got they had his call. The yeah, news. they got his license plate. <laughs> they didn't get the plate, they though. They didn't get the plate. Nah, it got to it. They had the plate in the front, so it must have been at least a Merlin thing. I mean, because, man, it's done. outrageous with these tickets, man. $250. And they lowered it down. That's the crazy part. Because I'm trying to get to work and save my job. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You won't give me a ticket for trying to save my job. And Merlin, that joint, same ticket be like 35 bucks. I pay them all day. The 35 I right. I pay them all day. But the two nifty? A good. <laughs> I'm not trying to pay. That's a, a good. That's a good night in Solitaire. Hey, I, I take hey, that. Hey, shout out to Solitaire. Solitaire. You know what I'm saying? Avenue, we man. definitely got to show you love to them. You know what I'm saying? Them my partners in there, man. Hey, man. Don't forget, we always recording at the DC Productions Music Hall and Comedy Club. We got our special guest, you know, Mr. Ralph. Hey, man. Give a round of applause. Special guest Ralphie Caban in yes, the building. Yes, yes. You know what I'm saying? He on that underground scene, my mm -hmm. man. He do battle rap. You know what I'm saying? We gonna let him. We gonna let him. We gonna let him get his off when he get up here. You for know sure. So, so stay tuned for that, man. Stay tuned, and also being that he's our guest, he's definitely the video of the week. Yeah. So you want to check it out right now, all right? TV. We at the Born Legacy Supreme PGs. Make some noise. Yeah. Yeah. I won't waste no time. Battling on my left. Profit. Philly. Let's go. Philly. Philly. That's it, man. Man, To my right. Robbie Gabon and C. Cali and they have DMV. We here. Let's work. So, so, okay. Okay. so uh -huh. Gabon, let's go. Shoot I'm light years ahead of this nigga. You can just feel the buzz. Even Pablo with a Picasso, you couldn't paint the plug. Connected with real goonies. But they still mad I made a name with drugs. It was all TLC at first. Until I made a name and told Norms I don't want no scrubs. I was trying to build my hood up. But Rocky Rose made me pave the streets. I say niggas like you was a prophet. Yeah, just another way to eat. Sun up to sundown. I got a family to feed the scope like God's view. And I'm just trying to show what prophets see. A threat to me? Uh -huh. You don't pose nothing. This shit act for you. You play the role of it. Well, this scene, I'm going to act too. Thank Roscoe. I'm knocking at your door with the nose running. Spanish in America? I moved the illegal. My mind different. I white cerebral. Anybody with you get hit too. I'm with two of your people. Y'all from Philly, right? So you should be used to getting let down by the eagles. I'm from a, I'm from a place. Well, they be up to no good. Legit and illegal. I ran two chains. Yeah, my trap house stood out in the hood. I'll let you decide. You pick your options. Even if I fire sticks, it's on demand. They pay per view to see the boxing left hook, uppercut. They see them dropping. URL gon' monetize the views. But either way, my hands is on the profit. We gon' fight to one man standing. I'm going to the death. Why they give me you? When Philly ain't had the answer since Iverson left, but fuck that. Cut the check, I need all respect, I'll cut his neck. Joy threes with a scope. He looking back at it. I just put it in retrospect. Fuck you, and that's on God. I brought drugs in a gun in here. It ain't in the car. Walked in with Jack. They ain't pat me down at all. Say something wrong, bow. You gonna see profit everywhere? Cause I rose the stock soon as I got the call. The best of them. We all eating. We the money team. I should choke you out. But I took the Connor up. Only getting paid to throw punches in the ring. Niggas was dick riding. Well, fuck them all. If you asking for your face painted, I'm quick to draw. Markel, folks, another DMV nigga. Philly hoping can change it all. That was the setup. He went first to scope it out. The shooter came second right behind him. I'm Lonzo Ball. I pull up with money on your head. In the briefcase, you chilling in the spot. Try eat your cheese steak. This a dead giveaway. Yeah, the chocolate sweet steaks. The shit I'm firing is no box. This shit cremates. See caliente, huh? Yeah. Give it up. Yo. So let's get 
one thing straight before I start rapping, nigga. <laughs> I can go from being joyful and laughing with you to stepping out of my bag and straight snapping, nigga. And I don't think you want that to happen. Because <laughs> I'm good at networking. See, I know a lot of dudes, man. Dudes who can give you a couple of metal rounds and take your paper like newsstands. But I don't want to do that. I want to turn you into a new man. So fall in line. Oh, 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 oh. come to my boot camp. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my boot camp. I'm Prophet, and I'm your worst fucking nightmare. I mean, what do we have here? A fucking hermaphrodite. Right? And we don't condone faggots, right? Facts. A fucking female maggot dyke. What am I looking at here? The cast off magic mic? Put <laughs> up your hands and fight, but straight in your face, because the last guy you don't know didn't make it in this place. We gave him. We gave them metaphors, imagery, and hard liners. Keep a pen and a pad and pull all nighters after low crawling in the mud surrounded by barbed wires. So straighten up there, soldier. Stop looking so soft. What's your name? Gabbana Bullshit. Your name is Snowball. <laughs> but don't, I said, but don't get it twisted. My type of writing is real. Like they say, Ralphie having a cookout? Cool. I hop right in the wheel. Drive through the DMV with a license to kill. Talking my shit. Spitting writing is real. Because you from Maryland, <laughs> Landover. And that just proves you ain't fucking with this soldier. When I land, it's over for any Landover. So rip the scale off the charts, that's 10 and over. I'll bring the world together. I'll bring Maryland back over and flip Land Rovers with electromagnetic bombs that'll shift tectonic plates and flip your Landover. So, oh, oh, oh. so go ahead, go. heckle me. I got something on my mind that'll make the heckler stop. An MG4, it's a heckless cotch, a belt fed, 556 five, light machine gun. Got it overseas, son, imported from the Germans. It's a mean one, but, but, but I don't live that life anymore. I'm, I'm a happy civilian, a misogynistic shoe salesman. I'm married with children, so. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I said, so do me a favor, Lane, stay in your lane before you see Damon Wayne bring you major pain for threatening the life I live. That just mean I keep a ball head in the top to protect my wife and kids. All right, what's up? We're back. We back, man. We back. As you can see, we got our special guest right here. Ralphie Gabbana, as promised. Man, let's give it up for my man right here. <laughs> Thank you, man. Thank you. Man. Yeah, you just checked out, you know, the rap battle between him and a dude named Prophet. You know. You know, doing it heavy for the DMV area. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, Ralphie, you know, tell us a little bit. What you like to go by? Robbie Gabbana, man, you know, right. C. Caliente, huh? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, on Bonnet as well, man. You know, I got a couple AKs. Man. Okay. You know, okay. Okay. Yeah. okay. So, look, though, man, you know, me and you been knowing each other for years. We mm -hmm. go back, you nice. know, single digits. Back. You know what I'm saying? So, I want to know what got you into the whole battle rap thing because I knew early on you was mm -hmm. rapping yeah. and, you know what I'm saying, all that. So, what put you there? To be honest with you, bro, um, my man drugs, you know what I'm saying? Okay. My man drugs, you know, he he, he uh, heavy, uh, heavy in the battle rap game from okay. the area. I've been coming on the URL and shit, you know what I'm saying? Y'all look out for drugs, man. That's my man. Okay. But, um, you know what I'm saying? He started doing it, you know what I'm saying? And with the music and shit, he was like, you know, for real, Slim, I think you should try to do that battle shit. Like, I real life think you could do that shit and uh -huh. come with something different. Like, it, they just need something different. You know what I'm saying? So I say, fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Give it a try. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right, no right. bullshit. Like, I'm still learning with this mm -hmm. shit, fool. Like, okay. But I'm going as I go. You feel me? But yeah, so that, I that's mean, how that shit I happens. can feel you because uh, me being a DJ, man, it's definitely a difference between club DJs, mm -hmm. battle rap DJs, and, you know, in between, all the in between, the EDMs. I mean, it's it's a craft to everything. You know what I'm saying? And and, and it, it takes some skill. You definitely got to sharpen your skills when you mm -hmm. you were like in a dungeon. You yeah, going in with a bunch of lions, that's bro. Yeah, because that's 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 a different type of situation. Yeah, that ain't you the just up there for real, yeah. that's, a, you just, uh. that's a whole different animal. Because I tell people like you mm -hmm. know when you do a song, you can hide behind a beat, you can yeah. hide behind a hook, mm -hmm. and you can get away with a lot of ad living over sure. over a beat. But Slim, for when sure. it's you and somebody across from you, uh -huh. it's quiet as shit in the room, uh -huh. and you gotta make it shake <laughs> with your words and your voice, Slim. For sure. Yeah, that's you. You feel me? That's a difference. And that feeling, I ain't gonna lie, 
is mm-hmm. what I do love about bad rush. That rush. Man. It's that rush, man. Yeah, because yeah, yeah. you, you know you ain't got amigos in the background like Cookie. <laughs> <laughs> you know Shout out yeah. to them, man. Yeah. They can't yeah. mess. Yeah, they can't they mess. They can't mess. They can't mess. Everything they touch is They can't mess. Yeah, they. You know what I'm saying? But it's like you know what I'm saying. It's a lot of people that can't get away with doing certain things and can't even do that. But it's like Slim, that beat. Good mm-hmm. producer, you got, you know what I'm saying? Good DJ mm-hmm. spinning your shit in the club for you. For sure. But I'm, make not, I'm not gonna hold you, bro. You know, I'm, you know, you know, we, 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 them New York type dudes, you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> bro, when you, when I first seen that you was doing battle rap, I ain't know nobody from the city mm-hmm. really was on it. It was crazy. And I was like, when I first seen that, I was mm-hmm. like, what? And if you want me to keep it 100, I want to shout out Capital Battlegrounds. Okay, Cause like, hey, it's yeah. a lot of, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of Bamas from this area that's been putting on for battle rap and got battle rap. Bama's from here, mm-hmm. put on on the biggest stages out of state. Right. So mm-hmm. shout out to them, the Bob Benners, the BYBs, you know what I'm saying, the Showtimes. But CBG, over like this year and a half, Slim has brought a lot of attention to making that shit a good look in the area and making people want to be a part of this shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to lie to you. Like, they, they bring out a good crowd for the area. You know what I'm saying? Bro, because, yeah. like, I mean, it's only a select few. And I ain't going to hold you. It's a select few people in the city that know about battle rap. Mm, yeah, you know for what I'm sure. saying? So for you it's, to really mm. have jumped in that scene, you mm. being from D.C., mm. that was that was a lot for me to yeah, see right mm. there. That was monumental, bro. Because it, it's, it's, full, it's full underground, man. Mm. And, um, I mean, we can't help to see, like, just a movement of yeah, everything, man. Yeah. Like, you know, anything takes work, man. Yeah, that's a you fact. know what I'm saying? And, and when you're doing your music thing and mm-hmm. you got your, you know, you gotta have your, your producer gotta be dope. Mm-hmm. You gotta be in tune. When you over here doing the show, you gotta be in tune yeah, with your right. folks, man. That's, people only recognize real, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? That's real. So uh, tell me a little bit about uh, any projects you might be having going man, in. Man, basically or? right now, man, around fall time, we drop out. Okay. Um, we okay. got New Legends, that's the brand, that's the label. New shout legends. out to okay. you know what I'm saying my folks shout out to my little brother L you know what I'm saying like that's that's like my partner we do everything together okay. and basically you know what I'm saying with that being said man like I'm working on a tape called R and Bana like okay. it's a feel of like R and B trap type of feel type shit like you know what I'm saying I like to say I Drake but you know Drake is his own man I'm my own man but that's True. the type of True. vibe and shit you get yeah. like I ain't a singer. I rap, but I can give you that vibe. You yeah, feel me? So like, sure. you know what I'm saying? You gonna make sure it's Jiggy Exactly. Though. So I want that's like the type of vibe I'm going for. So we looking for the fall. I don't know exact date right now, but we we've been working in the winter. I'm, I'm gonna tell you that right now. We've been in the studio. That's, that's what's a up. Fact. You feel that's me? what's up, yeah, man. Yeah. You know, every yeah. you know, projects take time. Yeah, Facts. You know what I'm saying? We you got to make sure this stuff. one is right because you know what I'm saying. I, sure. I got two. You know, it's two different sides. You got the battle rap side, mm-hmm. and you got the music side, and you can't mix the two because oh, it's yeah. two nah, totally different, different things. Different. And sure. I don't want to juggle too many eggs in one basket, mm-hmm. so that's why I've been taking my time with the battle. Mm-hmm. And, you know what I'm saying? Focusing on the music, you know what I'm saying? Hand to hand, because when you're doing one or the other, it's evil or awesome. something. Yeah, and the mm-hmm. crazy part about the, uh, the battle rap scene is, too, because it's some it's some dudes that really is vicious in the battle mm-hmm. rap, but it's hard for them to get their rap career mm-hmm. off the ground. That's man. real, mm-hmm. because... I ain't mean to cut you off, no, bro, but right. just to feed off that, it's because it's it's a balance. And when you one track minded in a sense, mm-hmm. where you just, you know what I'm saying, battling, 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 it's kill, kill, kill. That vibe come off even in your music at times. Mm-hmm. And sometimes it's like, Slim, I got to take three months away from being in kill mode against somebody I'm standing in front of and just relax, take a deep breath. Yeah. And just talk about some other shit. Just yeah, let it, sure. just let it vibe. Yeah. And that's the thing, you know what I'm saying? That 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 one track mind with that battle shit. It's like you can't. I'm telling you, for me personally, and I mm-hmm. see it with a lot of people. Music. It's either they do evil or, or you can tell it's battle rap. It's still battle yeah, rap in the music. Yeah, you feel sure. me? Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah man. Uh, so man, make sure you tell everybody how tell they can find they can you, bro. Find, bro. Um, at Ralphie Gabbana. You know what I'm saying? G A B B A N A. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Ralphie with a Y. You know what I'm saying? But um. That's on all my all my social media, from Twitter Insta- to Instagram. Facebook, the 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 Instagram. It's all the same. Just Ravi Gabbana. So look, mm-hmm. me being one of your men, mm-hmm. I want to know where the Gabbana came from, bro. This is funny, bro. <laughs> so this is the wildest part. Like, okay. high school, I used to wear a lot of polo shirts. Right, right. I remember. So they start calling me Ralph, like just being funny and shit. Uh-huh. And it's so crazy. This shit just stuck. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then to be so real with you. 
I don't need, I've never owned nothing Dolce & Gabbana. <laughs> <laughs> to keep it a bean. But uh, the Gabbana shit just sounded so fire to yeah, me, bro. Yeah. I stabbed it. And I got that shit tatted on me when I was like 19, fool. Uh, and that shit is on me for life, bro. Uh, and shout out to Stefano Gabbana, the head nigga Dolce & Gabbana. I follow him, he follow me. <laughs> Much love to him, bro. You know what I'm saying? So if he cool Real with it, that, I'm bro. cool with it, you know. Mm. So shout out to that. So, you know, it's, sure. it's love. But the Gabbana shit just sound fire. I ain't yeah, gonna hold with you. I ain't got no inspiration from that shit. I just chose that shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, That's what's up, man. We, we definitely appreciate you coming to the show, yeah, blessing man. us, yeah, man. Yeah. Always. I definitely man. appreciate that, man. Oh, yeah, definitely man. appreciate that. And man. we gonna shoot this for the platform, man, for yeah. battle rapping. Mm -hmm. Ralphie Gabbana in the building. Yeah, always, man. And Shout out, man. Shout out to the fellas for having me, man. For sure, man. for sure. So we it's. It's your boy DJ Mix I am. It's your boy Passport Los and we the crazy. And we out. All right. We are the craze. Yeah, we are the craze. DMV spotlight, no better time in no place. Time to undo all the hate with a place that allows you to show off all the talent you embrace. We are the craze. Yeah, we are the crates, yeah. No time for fake ones, only for the real. DMV, you know the deal. From the skins to the nationals, the weirds to the capitals, the capital here. We are the yeah. A place to showcase your skills, a voice how you feel. More than music, this is more than appeal. The crates, where everybody free to voice their opinion, where growth and inspiration is the mission. We are the crates. Where the goal is real specific, and that's putting off of Maryland, Virginia, and the District of Crest. The topics vary from the grimy to the gritty, mixing lows. Gone through it for the city. We are the craze.